maybe you have seen this or this. And if you look at it, mapapansin mo there is a common theme, and that is why the central bank discourages us from hoarding excessive amount of coins or money. I am no expert in economics, but by knowing these two concepts made me realize kung bakit ayaw ng central bank natin for us to store our own money. First is it is inefficient. Second is it disrupts the supply of money in our economy. First, let me talk about efficiency and why it is inefficient for us to store our own money rather than just put it in a bank. That is you, and this is your money. That is all the things that happen when you store your own money. Now, let's compare it to this scenario. That is you, that is a bank, that is a debtor. This is your money, you save it in a bank. The bank lends a portion of your money to a debtor with interest. The debtor uses that money for business capital, makes a profit from his business, pays debt to the bank. You withdraw your money from the bank to pay for something that you need. To clarify things, that is not a definite cycle. I just showed you an ideal example of how the money flows when you save your money from the bank rather than yourself. And it makes more sense, right? Now, let's talk about the supply and demand side of money. Based from this and this, uh, naisip ko na yung central bank natin prints money regularly based on their target. Now, imagine this scenario. There's a balance in the demand and supply of money in our economy. And this is what happens when too much people decided to hoard too much coins or money on their own storage. It disrupts the amount of money circulating in our economy. But if you are thinking, why not just print more money to balance the hoarded money? It's possible but it will cause the currency to lose some value. The next time you know someone who has a lot of money and they store it on their own, you might want to share this info and this might help them. And that's it for now. Peace. I'm out. Bye. If you enjoy watching this episode, please consider subscribing and hit the like button. I'll be releasing this kind of content every second and fourth week of the month. That's all I have for now. Hope you got something meaningful from this episode. Goodbye and have a great day.